71 cases are of Namibian nationals, while one is a South African female cross-border truck driver who was tested in Kietman Swap. 68 cases are from Valves Bay, one from Sokopmund, and two cases from Oshana and Nohangwena regions. The one in Oshakati traveled from Horses Bay on the 22nd of June 2020 and got quarantined in Oshakati. A specimen was collected on the 3rd July 2020. No COVID-19 related symptoms were detected by them. The one from Nguera was visited by an acquaintance from Horses Bay in June 2020 who went back on the 17th of June 2020. At that time, he had no symptoms consistent with COVID-19. However, upon return, he developed COVID-19 symptoms, was tested, and the result came out positive. On the one COVID-19-related death, which was announced on the 10th of July, the minister clarified why a case is labeled as such. A death due to COVID-19 is defined as a death resulting from a clinically compatible illness in the probable or confirmed COVID-19 case. There should be no period of complete recovery from COVID-19 between illness and death. A death due to COVID-19 may not be attributed to another disease, for example, cancer, and should be counted independently of pre-existing condition. A person who died due to COVID-19 is buried by the state and not by the family. Namibia now has 785 confirmed COVID-19 cases with 758 active. Case number 17 has recovered, bringing the total of recoveries to 26. Evelyn Paulus, NBC News, Venduk.